What is up, you guys? Me again. So, um, do I deserve to go to heaven because I'm autistic? Do I deserve to go to heaven because I was born with autism? And the answer to that is absolutely not. I don't deserve to go to heaven because I'm autistic. I don't deserve to go to heaven for any reason. I don't deserve it. What I do deserve from God is his punishment, his righteous judgment, wrath on me in hell for eternity. All right, I'm not trying to rhyme or anything, <laughs> but um, that is what I deserve. The only thing I deserve from God is his wrath and judgment in hell for eternity. But God so loved the world that he sent his one and only begotten son that whoever shall believe in him will be uh, saved, have an everlasting life. Admit to Lord Jesus Christ. Confess the sins that, you're fe- that you feel sorry for, that you feel regret, guilt over, that I have a pit that you have like a pit in your stomach um, that make you feel sick. Confess them to Jesus Christ. Tell them, tell them you're sorry. Um, admit to him that you're a sinner worthy of death and hell for all eternity. Believe that he died on the cross to save you from your sins 2,000 years ago. And that he was buried and that God the Father rose him again on the third day. Invite him into your heart. Invite him into your life. Give your heart to him. Accept him as your Lord and Savior. And he will fill you with the Holy Spirit and make you a born-again Christian if you truly say that that prayer with all your heart believe it with all your heart that he died 2,000 years ago on the cross to save you from your sins it's the only way to heaven there's no other way to salvation there's no other name above heaven or uh, there's no other name in heaven um, by which we must be saved I wonder it's kind of like a tongue twister but um only Jesus can save us from our sins because he's God and he lived the perfect sinless life. He took upon the punishment, um, the wrath and judgment of his father while he was un- un- upon himself, while he was nailed to the cross. Um So, do I deserve to go to heaven because I'm autistic? Does that give me a free pass? Well, it it did when I was under the age of accountability. But not because I'm autistic, but because of what Jesus Christ already did for me on the cross 2,000 years ago. So, no, I don't deserve to go to heaven. Period. Nothing. I don't deserve anything from God. I don't deserve his love, his mercy, his forgiveness, nothing. All I deserve from him is his wrath. But he loves me and you so much that he gave us a way to be saved from hell. He gave us a way to be saved from the eternal torment. So, no. None of our attributes... Um, I don't know if attributes is the right word to say. Nothing that we were born with or that we can do will ever be enough to be saved from the lake of fire. Only Jesus Christ can save you. He is the only way to heaven. He is the only reason you are going to heaven in the first place. Because of what he did for you on the cross. You don't deserve heaven. You don't. But he loves you so much that he made it only... He made it the way possible to to go back to God. 
you were once dead, lost in your sins, and on your way to the lake of fire for eternity. But Jesus died on the cross to save you from your sins. He made the way. He made the way when there was none else. Um, well, there was in the old covenant, but um, that was really difficult to do. But now Jesus paid it all, past, present, and future sins. It says it's clear, it's very clear, um, those who believe in the Son will have life, but those who do not believe in the Son will not see life, but the wrath of, of God abide on them. So if you have pla- if you placed your faith in Jesus Christ at any time in your life, you are saved, you have your you're sealed with the Holy Spirit. Um it's that simple. He already did everything. You just have to have faith. He considers your trust in his sacrifice as his own righteousness and we can stand before him and his father in heaven as if we've never sinned because God the father says he casts our sins into the sea of forgetfulness and takes our transgressions from us and throws them to the east and to the west so we basically stand in front of God as if we've never sinned all he sees on us is Jesus's blood that's washed and purified us from our sins. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you're autistic and if the devil is whispering in your ear saying, oh, you don't, you, you don't deserve to go to heaven. I mean, you don't deserve to go to hell. You're autistic. You deserve to go to heaven. God loves you even more than other people because you're autistic. That's a lie from the devil. Let me tell you right now, it is a lie from Satan. God loves everybody equally. And you don't deserve to go to heaven just because of something that you're born with or something that you do. You can't earn salvation and you can't get it by being born with something. So let me tell you, it is a lie from the devil if, he's, if, he, if you think that you deserve to go to heaven because of something that you did in this world, in this life that you can somehow earn it by being a good enough person or giving money to charity or homeless people or whatnot. No, you can't get to heaven by your own merits. It's only by what Jesus did 2,000 years ago on the cross at Calvary to save you from your sins. That is the only way to be saved. That is the only way when we place our faith in Jesus Christ as our Lord and Savior, believe in what he did for us 2,000 years ago on that cross, dying a horrific death for you on that cross 2,000 years ago, that is the only way to be saved. He saves us because of what he's already done. Nothing that we've done or could ever do. He took upon the wrath of his father while he's hanging there nailed to the cross so we wouldn't have to take the wrath of the father upon us in hell for eternity. So let me that let that just sink into your mind. So I hope you guys enjoy.